Rock Hopper, written by Bruce Raymond. Three is Sanglamore, written by Pat Edery, who's riding in his 15th King George and who's won it twice. Four is Sapiens, written by Willie Carson, riding in his 15th King George. He's won it four times. Five is Terriman, written by Michael Roberts, who's riding in his fourth. He's won it once in 88. Seven is Tiger Flower, written by Steve Corth and riding in his ninth. He won it in 87. Eight is Generous with Alan Munro riding in his first King George VI and Queen Elizabeth Diamond Stakes. Nine is Hailsham, written by Ray Cochran, riding in the race for the third time. Ten is Lucia Roverti, written by Frankie Dottori, his second ride in the race. And twelve is Saddler's Hall, on which Lester Piggott will be riding in his 30th race, and he's won it no less than seven times. Generous is six to four on, uh, Sadler's Hall six to one against. Rock Hopper and uh, Sanglamore eight to one. Huge gap then to Tiger Flower 25 to one, same price as uh, Terramon on 40 to one Sapiens. Lucciverti is 66 to one, and Hailsham 100 to one. And that's it. They're under orders. And they're off. Generous one of those in the early stages, but Hailsham going on. Hailsham going on now, the Italian derby winner from Lucia Roberti, then Sadler's Hall. Then comes Generous on the outside of Tiger Flower. Behind them, Rock Hopper, then Sapiens. Behind Sapiens is Terraman, and Sanglamore is the back marker, and Hailsham is the leader. Hailsham by two lengths from Sadler's Hall in second. Now behind Sadler's Hall is Lucia Roberti. Then comes Generous behind Generous, Tiger Flower, then Rock Hopper, then Terraman on the inside of Sapiens, and still last is Sanglamore more as they race down into Swindley Bottom at a tremendous gallop. They're just racing up to the milepost already and still Hailsham blazing the trail from Sadler's Hall in second and third. Lucia Roverti fourth is generous. Behind generous comes Tiger Flower, then Rock Hopper, then Terriman, and then Sapiens and Sangler Moore still last and it's still Hailsham the leader by about four to five lengths now from Sadler's Hall as they pass the seven furlong marker and behind Sadler's Hall comes Lucia Roverti and then generous traveling well in fourth place behind him comes rock hopper and tiger flower and then terraman behind terraman is sapiens behind sapiens is sanglamore they're racing towards the five pole and it's still hailsham in the lead from saddler's hall going well in second then comes lucha reverti then generous going smoothly on the outside tiger flowers improving on the inner then comes rock hopper then terraman then sapiens and then sanglamore and lester pickett has taken over now on saddler's hall as they've got three and a half furlongs to run. Sadler's Hall is the leader from Lucha Roberti with Generous moving into third place, then Tiger Flower. Rock Hopper making ground towards the outside. Sanglamore's moving into a challenging position. Just in behind them come Sapiens and Terriman. As they turn into the home stretch, it's Lester Piggott on Sadler's Hall in the lead from the favourite Generous. Generous coming to tackle Sadler's Hall. The three year old takes it up now, and it's the three year old Generous who stormed into the lead from Sadler's Hall. Rock Hopper and Sanglamore throwing down a challenge now towards the near side, but Generous has the clear advantage as they come down to the furlong pole. Generous from Sanglamore in second, then comes Rock Hopper as they race up towards the line. Generous is going to win the King George the Sixth and Queen Elizabeth Diamond Stakes in terrific style. He races towards the line, five, six lengths clear. Generous has won it, being eased up. Sanglamore is second, Rock Hopper is third. Fourth is Terriman, five, Sapiens, six, Sadler's Hall. Seven behind him came Lucia Roberti, then Tiger Flower, and last was Hailsham. And so the result of the 1991 King George VI and Queen Elizabeth Diamond Stakes is first, number eight, Generous, owned by Prince Fahd Salman, trained by Paul Cole, his first ever runner in the race, ridden by Alan Munro, his first ever ride in the race. Second was number three, Sanglamore, owned by Mr. Khalid Abdullah, trained by Roger Charlton and ridden by Pat Edery. And third was number two, Rock Hopper, owned by Sheikh Maktoum Al Maktoum, trained by Michael Stout and ridden by Bruce Raymond. Fourth was number five, Terriman. First, number eight, Generous, six to four on favorite. Second, number three, Sanglamore, seven to one. Third, number two, Rock Hopper, eight to one.